가져가. 먹방. So today I'm doing carbo bulldog bokkumyeon. You know, it's the super spicy noodles. They have so many different additions. But this one, I might really, this might be my favorite. Oh, I haven't tried it yet. We'll find out. Just because this is um, not spicier from the original, but it's actually more mild and creamier. So, which is like, I love creamy pastas, you know? So, or even any kind of noodles. So I think I will really, really like this one. And it's not available in the U.S. yet. I think it's available on Amazon though. My sister, she actually came from Korea not too long ago and I told her, oh my god, this is one thing that you have to bring for me. And she was really, really kind enough to bring me 10 of these. Well, of course, she took a couple and my mom didn't take, I don't know. I gave it to a couple of my friends and I'm only eating one today because I have side of like dumplings and other fried things right here. And this is the kimmari, um, the for the glass noodles and with seaweed paper i am giving away two because you know, i don't have a lot and i don't have it's not available here so i am giving away two so this is a very very small giveaway i'm gonna give away two i actually wanted to give away this one slippers and if you guys were on my instagram you guys know that i thought about giving away these pair of slippers that my sister got from me from korea i thought about it i don't need it but i thought about it and I'm just like, well, my sister got it for me, you know, and I don't want to just give that away like that. So I think I'll give it to my mom or even if, even if, or I might just like keep it in stock and maybe use it when my other one just wears out. So I am just doing the two spicy noodle giveaway. Um, so to enter, well, make sure to subscribe and like this video. And I want you guys to comment your resolution, the 2018 resolution. Um, it can be specific. It can be general. It's going to be completely random pick so yeah so everybody has equal chance i no not everybody doesn't have equal chance because it's, it's going to be domestic i'm so sorry for international it just it just gets lost too many too often and i i feel like it just gets too complicated for two pack of noodles you know so it is only domestic so and also make sure to tell me where you like what state what state you guys are from and your resolutions and all that um so let's just I'm very excited. This got pretty good reviews. I'm only gonna eat one. Ooh, look how pinky it is. Um, this one is the powder. And then, I think this is this is the original spicy sauce. Oh no, oh, I guess this is the creamy powder and this is the original. It's, I mean, you can already tell this is a lot bigger than this one, so I don't think it's going to be that spicy. The noodles look same. And I think they are celebrating like their billion, like they sold over a billion or something, million or billion, I don't know. I can't read Korean. It's like sheep okke. I don't know how much sheep ok is. So, and these are actually homemade dumplings from my mom. She gave it to me. I was like, it's perfect because I was about to go buy some. And um, when I picked up my sister and stopped by my mom, she's like, you want like dumplings I made some? I'm like, oh my gosh, I'm filming something tomorrow. Perfect. So I got that and just left over that stuff. I'm pretty hungry. It just worked out. Oh, and on the side, I have some boiled eggs. And then on top of it, I'm going to add some bacon. I don't even know if these are cooked yet. I'm gonna just try it. Mm. And as long as these are not frozen, I'm okay. Mm. These are kind of spicy. I don't know why. Mm. Mm. And my, I think these are kimchi dumplings. I have three right here that are pan fried, boiled, or steamed. Look how big she makes them. Okay, my face is big, but you get the idea. It's pretty big. Oh, yeah, this is juicy. Oh, wow. I'm not gonna lie. This is like one of the best ones that she ever made for me. Mmm. I think dumplings make the best, they pair very well with spicy things. I'm 
and just start taking out a lot of water. I'm going to add the spicy, the original, original sauce first. Add the the creamy sauce. That looks like parmesan and parsley. Okay, I'm going to top it out with bacon. Oh, ooh. And then some eggs. One egg. Mmm. Add some bacon. Mm. It smells like, you know more milkier spicy noodles mm. oh my god it's not spicy at all wow i really like this it's not spicy You definitely taste the original flavor. Definitely. Still like a little bit spicy. Like tea. Wow. And it's the the creamy sauce is not overwhelming either. Well wow, this is pretty good. Oh my gosh. I look bacon. Mm. I think one day um, start selling them in local markets here hopefully I think I'm gonna get a lot this is pretty good mm. it's very similar to you know when you just add like half and half or cream, heavy cream in the spicy noodles. Very similar, but it still has I think this tastes better. <laughs> oh no. It's not good. They're like super stuck. What I wanted to do, dip it in here. Get the sauce. Wow. Wow. So good. Mmm. Man, I haven't had any carbs yesterday. No carbs yesterday. So this is really like hitting the spot. getting a little spicier <clears throat> so doable I think it's significantly less spicier less spicy than the original flavor 
for sure. You guys have to try this. Oh my gosh, this is so good. Dip it in here like this. I'm glad that I left a little more extra water in here because I get the extra sauce. Yeah, my mom really hooked it up. <laughs> so much in here. When you guys are buying dumplings, <clears throat> some dumplings are very cheap because they're machine made. But if you get those Korean dumplings that says handmade, like triple the pr triple the price. You have to put bacon in here. It's getting a little spicy. <clears throat> you know, a while ago, I feel somebody asked me, why do, why do I, I don't know if it was specifically asked towards me or in general, they asked, why do you guys lick your um, chopstick after you eat something? Like, you know, I, I eat this, um, and then I pick, it up, pick up another thing. I think because we just do that because we don't want anything dripping or like extra stuff on here. That's just, I think that's really it. But it's so funny how every like Asian does it. <laughs> I think my least favorite out of all these edition, I would have to say the soup one, Buddha Bukkum Tang Mian. I think that was my least favorite. My resolution, actually this is one of my resolution, is not to swear so much. <laughs> you know, just in general. Like, less. Swear less. Cause I feel like 
sometimes you just have to say it and it just makes you feel better. So it's not, ne- I really think some, at one point it's necessary because you just have to let it out and there's no way, other way to explain, but then to like, you know, swear and cause it just, it just makes sense. So full. Okay. I lied. It's still pretty spicy. Not as spicy as the original, but it might be a little spicier than for, for me than normal because I haven't had spicy food in a long time. The sauce is pretty good. I kind of want to put the sauce in the dakbokki and the rice cakes. I think it'll be really good. Oh. Okay, I'm going to end the video here. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Uh, if you guys want to win, if you guys want to win two carbo brudak bokkumyeon or creamy super spicy noodles, uh, make sure to subscribe, like this video, and in the comment box, let me know where you guys are from and your 2018 resolution. And that's really it. I think I'm gonna make this about, I think I'm gonna wait about a week and then do a random, pick one random person and do a giveaway. So, bro, also, can you leave your email so I can directly email you and I get exchange like information or something like that? That's really it. I hope you guys enjoy your weekend. Stay safe. Have fun. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye, guys.